Saint-Étienne, 10-time champions of France, faced Judgment Day Le Bourgeois, which brought up some distressing memories. The last time Le Vert were relegated, they lost on the 12th of May 2001 at Nantes. The Canaries, on that occasion, clinched the last of their eight championship titles. No Ligue 1 Uber Eats hexagon at stake, but Antoine Coumbaret's side did claim their first major trophy since that day by lifting the 2022 Coupe de France. Pascal Dupré's side were 90th of goal difference, meaning Sante needed to better mess his result to go into the relegation playoff. Encouragement then that Le Grena were away at Champions PSG, yet their own finishing continued to be wayward. Dennis Buanga failing to beat Alban Lafont. Instead, beating his post. 42 goals, the fifth worst total in the division. But it's at the back where they've been wide open. 76 on an eye-watering total, with only bottom Bordeaux worse. And a penalty to Nantes. Look to extend that to 77. A tug on Ludovic Blas's shirt, enough for the referee. And the Nantes number 10 did exactly what he did in the Coupe de France final. Smash home. The fifth successive penalty in Liga Nubris this season. And hitting double figures in successive seasons. Rando Colo Muani will bid farewell to Nantes with a five year contract signed with Europa League champions Frankfurt. Champions League football awaits. He set up Blas for Paul Bernadoni, denying him a second. On course, they fare for a fifth straight defeat and therefore automatic relegation, ending their 21 year stretch in the top flight. Yet Nantes had lost five of the last six on the last day of the season. Roman Amuma determined to celebrate his 10th campaign with Sonte by giving them one last chance at survival next week. Playoff with Ozer beckons for a mess or Sonte. Dennis Buanga desperate to make sure it was Levert. But a stunning save from Alban Lafont. Denying Buanga after a brilliant improvisation. Momuani found himself in on goal, but he couldn't beat Bernardoni. Ludovic Blas setting up Samuel Mutusami. Bernardoni wasn't to be beaten. Sante remaining in contention to get above Mess into that 18th spot. Not knocking at the door to relegate them. And it still could have happened. Could have been a perfect end to a wonderful time at Nantes. But Muani striking too close. Bernardoni, brilliant positioning. Leaving Lever with a chance. Instead, it was a veteran that breathed life into Lever's survival hopes. What a time to get your 50th league goal for your club. Amuma once again. A difference maker for Saint-Étienne. Just his second of the season, but one of his most important, Pascal Duprat. Kick-starting the celebrations. They'll have to refocus. Ozer defeating Sochaux on penalties to earn a place in the playoff. Saint-Étienne will face them for a place in the top flight next season.